Hi, today we will discuss analysis of frames by using Connish method. Okay, with this way condition. First step is we need to find the degree of freedom. Okay, 3j minus or minus m. Here we had a 4 giant 1, 2, 3, 4, 4 giants. Okay, 4 giants A, B, C, D, and the reactions 6 reactions because fixes support 3 reactions, fixes support 3 reactions total. 3 plus 3 6 reactions and members 1 2 3 3 members okay 3 members so we got degree of freedom is 3 so we need to fix the boundary condition so theta a equal to 0 because fixed support fixed support theta is equal to 0 and theta b equal to theta b and theta c equal to theta c and theta d equal to 0 okay and delta 1 equal to or base delta a b equal to delta because the condition and delta b to c equal to 0 because there is no displacement and delta c to d is equal to delta because there is some displacement ok and next uh, step 3 is fixed end moment condition so fixed end moment condition a to b they don't have any external loading conditions ok external loading condition in between the giant to a to b so we have a Fixed moment condition fixed to be zero, fixed to end condition B to zero, and B to C is uniformly distributed load over the 20, so uniformly distributed load WL square by 12. Okay, here take it as a clockwise rotation is positive from the right, so from the right clockwise rotation is positive, or take it as a clockwise rotation is positive uh, here. Uh, anti clockwise rotation is here clockwise this only we need to balance so here we will get minus okay here we will get minus okay to make the balance okay minus 120 sorry 1 minus 20 into 6 square by 12 that is equal to 60 here plus 60 as usual well, and c to d there is no external loading condition fixed moment is zero Step for go for rotation factors okay so rotation factor as we know that uh, minus 1 by 2 k by summation of k so from the our joints b b and c we need to make the equilibrium okay so b to a is 4 a by l, l because there is a b to a is fixed support so a support is fixed support oh. so one end is fixed far end also fixed we will get 4 a by l one end is fixed uh, or far end is hinge or roller we will get 3i by l ok so remember these two formulas ok so b to c is 4i by l so uh, i i is 2 times of i as you know that summation of k at b giants so this two sum 8 by 3i so we will get rotation factor with respect to b to a is minus 2.5 minus 2.5 ok similarly here b to C to B is 4 E I by L so L is 3 I by L ok sorry 4 E I by L but E I is a 2 times of E I so 4 by 3 E I and C to D is 4 E I by 3 because this is roller support ok so as you know that of, uh, here also 4 E I by L L is 3 so we will get this rotation factors next step 5 we need to go for distribution factor sorry displacement factors ok displacement factor as we know that displacement factor for say condition only here we are getting a b c and d ok in this case we are getting and b to c a and b c to d these two members are getting to sway so sway moment okay so for this we need to check this two cases only so for story one only so a to b one is and d to c and to a to b and d to c these two things 4a by l 4a by l okay so summation of k is 8 by 3 ei so so the displacement factor is minus 3 minus 3 by 2 k by summation of k okay minus 3 by 2 k by summation of k it's very important formula so we got minus 
point seven five minus point seven five. Okay. Next note story moment. So story moment equal to story story shear. Okay. S R equal to story shear. Okay. Story shear H R equal to height of story. Height of story. Okay. Story shear height of stress. So story moment equal to by three, okay. Uh, story height of story moment shear into story height of story by three. That is equal to fifty kilonewton meter. Next step is Carnes moment. So 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 find the way. So we need to find the Carnes moment. We need to draw the diagram. And for equilibrium positions, we need to make the Carnes boxes. This is the two equilibrium boxes. Okay, balancing moments. So uh, this is a. And this is B joint, and this is C joint, and this is B joint. Okay, so here first uh, we need to draw in middle of the box. Sorry, so we, we need to draw the first fixed moment condition 0, 0, minus 60 plus 60, 0, and 0. Okay, then we need to find the sum of the fixed moment at middle, sum of the fixed moment at middle. Okay, then third step is we need to draw the Rotation factors, rotation contribution factor A to B to A, B to C, C to B, and C to D. Okay, after that, we need to draw the dis displacement factors here. This is A to, A to B, and this is D to C. Okay, this is our hmm, main theorem. Hmm, okay. For moment, for finding the moment, so for distribution moment, we need to follow some moment. rotation factor into sum of fixed end moments. Okay, sum of fixed end moment plus near end moment plus far end moment plus displacement hmm, due to the story moment. <coughs> okay, sorry, displacement due to the story moment. Okay. For displacement due to the story moment, we will get um, from story moment plus rotation of contribution of the top and bottom end of moment. Top from bottom ends of moments. Okay, top and bottom ends of moment displacement. This is very important. Remember this formula. And first step. So go for first cycle. Go for first cycle. Here. So start from here, B to A. Uh, B to A is uh, B to A rotation factor minus 0.25 into CHC rotation factor 0.25 into summation of fixed end moment 60 plus near end moment is 0 initially and far end moment is 0 um, initially and displacement. Uh, moment is 0 initially ok this is 15 and similarly B to C is also 15 and coming to position C ok this is rotation this is rotation factor sorry some, somewhat up for oh, sorry see here Rotation factor of B, C to B is point minus point two five into sum of fixed moment sixty. Okay. Next uh, near end moment is it will become B to C. Okay. And far end moment is zero. Okay. Far end moment zero. It will get uh, minus eighteen point seven five. Okay. Minus eighteen point seven five. Similarly here also. Then, then. We finished the okay. We finished uh, this moments. Then we need to go for displacement moments. Okay, we need to go for displacement moments. So, so for this displacement can be minus 7.5 into into story moment. What the story moment here? Story moment is equal to HR is by 3. That is equal to 50 into 3 by 3 that is equal to 50 okay here we got 50 okay first story moment is 50 okay mm, less 
top and bottom moment so bottom moment is 0 top moment is 15 okay and here bottom moment is 0 top is minus 18.75 okay check here okay this top and bottom for a b and c to b okay we will get minus 34 points here similarly here also same thing okay this is first cycle over repeat the cycle until unless the repetition of cycle is same okay then second cycle go to second one go to second one and b to a minus 0.25 into summation of fixed time moment is six minus 60 plus bottom is 0 minus foreign moment is minus 18.75 this is we will become foreign moment we know no need to take this uh, this is uh, not this is near in moment this is due to the moment uh, due to the sway okay we need to take this this one so 0 is near in moment foreign moment is minus 18.75 okay minus 18.75 foreign moment is minus 18.75 okay 18.75 now we need to take the sway moment okay the sway moment to the sway moment okay this is this is the sway moment now we need to take here the nearest sway moment so it will become this 28 point 28.36 now similarly we need to find the this is 28.36 okay similarly we need to find the algebra I am not uh, mentioning all moments if you have any doubt uh, go for this if you have any doubt uh, pass the video and check the correction okay five final moment uh, when first of all we need to draw the serial number MAB, MBA, MBC, MCB like this so this is the balancing moments it's better to write uh, this table and first of all we need to draw the fixed moment so fixed end moments and next to near end moment the two times of near end moment okay two times of near in moment okay two times of near in moment zero zero so final cycle we got this so this is our near in moment from the Karnes box equations then we we need to write the foreign moment so b a is become the a b to foreign moment a b is foreign moment of b a it's like this so we need to shuffle this shuffle okay we need to shuffle then sum of a b i do the sway this is do the sway there is no sway so sum of moments will become the final moments okay sum of all column it will become the final moments so this is our diagram this is our diagram so a b is minus 22.65 minus i uh, minus means we need to go anti clockwise because clockwise rotation is positive so rotation is anti clockwise so our line is like this and uh, at uh, b to a 8.1 plus 8.1 the clockwise direction so clockwise direction is somewhat of all so this is somewhat down and somewhat of all like this like, like this okay and again again b to c is anti clockwise also of all direction and next 71.65 so uh, clockwise direction of all this is suffered so there is no sorry this is here we had uh, uniform distributed load so we need to add parabola and here one clock direction of the upper direction of the here also one clock direction the load is come there so this is our bending moment diagram so this is easy steps to draw the bending moment diagram thank you